Welcome back, Falcons, to this Friday, February the 5th. I'm Cameron. And I'm Danielle. Welcome back, guys. First up this week, Paul's giving you the weekly movie review. Hello everyone, I'm Paul, and welcome to this week's movie review. Now, because there is a new Godzilla vs. King Kong movie that is going to be coming out soon, I thought it would be a good idea to watch the one made in 1962. Keyword, thought. Listen, the movie is pretty accessible like I, I it was like was it, the entire movie on YouTube for free if, if you want to watch it I don't think you should but I can't stop you because of COVID that was this week's movie review have a great weekend thanks Paul now here's the culinary class with their soup competition Hey CB Falcons, uh, what you're seeing here is our first opportunity to have a cooking competition this year in the food service careers class. Uh, we usually like to do three competitions per year, but obviously we've been uh, unable to do that. But this is the soup challenge, the soup competition. And in third period, we've got a big class with eight awesome groups going right now. And we're gonna have eight or seven or eight awesome judges coming in here in a moment and fill, taste in these soups, which are all at a pretty professional level. I'm really pleased with what I'm seeing and um, looking forward to more of the same as the year goes on. Alright, hi, I'm Brandon, and our group is making Zuppa Toscana. It's an Italian soup. It has sausage and bacon and potatoes and kale in it, and um, it's really good. And I have a good feeling that we're going to win, but, you know, I'm just going to let the judges decide. We look forward to seeing next year's soup competition, guys. Great job. Now here's Jordan with the weather. Hey there, Falcons. It's me, Mr. Eggle. And, well, Mr. Eggle. Here's the weather. Today, you can expect a high of 64 with some sun. Tomorrow, you can also expect a high of 64 with a little bit of clouds. And on Sunday, expect a high of 63 with some sun. Next week, expect a slow, little bit of chance of precipitation with a high of about 60 for each day. Anyways, Falcons, that's all for this week's weather. We'll see you next week. Thanks for that, Jordan. And now, here's Mr. Frederick and Dylan with the weekly meme review. Welcome back, Falcons, to our weekly history meme review. I'm Dylan, and this is Mr. Frederick. Okay, what we have here is a meme about the Eastern Front in World War II, uh, which was mostly fought between the Soviet Union and Germany. Um, and on the Western Front, things were going well uh, for the Germans. Um, Eastern Front, not so much. So overall on the Eastern Front, uh, the low estimate is 30 million soldiers died. Um, that was like 60 to 80% of all German deaths in World War II were on the Eastern Front. Um, 1,700 towns were destroyed, um, not to mention livestock and factories and everything else. And it was exceedingly cold. It's in Russia. They didn't learn anything from Napoleon. So overall, German soldiers not having a good time on the Eastern Front. 
That's it for this week's episode of History Meme Review. Make sure you come back next week for another blast from the past. Thanks, Dylan. Now here's Mr. Turner with his weekly update. Good morning, Central Valley High School. I want to congratulate everybody on a fantastic spirit week. Everybody did a great job, <clears throat> saw a ton of school spirit. All the classes represented very, very well. And I know you had a great time, as did I. Back to normal attire next week, of course. Uh, it was a little comfy this week, but we still want to celebrate today uh, with the red, white, and blue day. Show your school spirit. Also remember, next week, we have an achieve period as well. We had one this week, so we're going back to back with progress reports coming out soon. Really important that you get the help you need. And then also for seniors, FAFSA is due coming up in a couple of weeks. We wanna make sure you're taking care of those deadlines. Actually a little bit later on in the month, early March, uh, we have those deadlines we have to meet. So make sure you're taking care of all the things you need to, to make sure you get as much aid as you can and get as much help as you can. Also excited that cross country starting up. Uh, we're really hoping that we can get more sports going. Of course, we can only do so much in terms of the the rules and the guidelines that are uh, kind of in line with the health protocols. So we want to make sure that uh, we're rooting them on and we're certainly hoping that we can get as many student athletes out there competing for Central Valley doing a great job. That's all for now. I hope you had a wonderful week. We will see you very, very soon. Take care and feel the Falcon pride. Well, Falcons, we hope you've enjoyed this crazy episode of the Falcon Weekly. Once again, I'm Cameron. And I'm Danielle. Have a great weekend, guys.